up, everybody? It's your boy, King Relic, back from Denver Ninja Gaming. Today, I got a pretty cool haul to show you guys. But first, I want to say sorry, guys. I have been so bad this last, I would say, month about posting on my regular schedule. I'm trying to get better. I just had a lot of stuff going on at work, at home with the new baby. So I've been really busy. Haven't been able to record or get a lot of stuff to do videos on. So trying to stack up a little bit and i don't live stream because i don't got a cam um so i can record so i got a few things i wanted to show off to you guys and uh yeah let's get into it first thing i want to show you guys something my homeboy picked up for me me and my homeboy always getting each other shit he knows i'm a very big chucky ghostface collector so he's always out on the stroll looking for shit for me. He picked me up something because I got him recently a really big Michael Myers Neko figure. Like a huge like 14 inch one or some shit. is crazy. But I got with JSA authentication a full signed script by Skeet. Ulrich, I think his last name is, who is Billy in Scream. So this right here is the full screenplay of the movie Scream, signed by your main killer, Billy. So it's really, really fucking sick. The homie's always looking out and getting me cool shit like this. So I'm super excited about that. Let me put this back into the envelope so I don't fuck it up. Alrighty then. Okay, so I'm just about done putting it back in the thing. I'm trying to make sure not to rip anything because of it being paper. Don't want to fuck up the script at all. So that was it. And then I went through to my collectible shop that I go to. And before we went to the collectible shop, we went to this new store. It's like a dollar store. It's called Five and Below. Everything in the store is $5 or under. And I picked up this sick Fiend. It's just a little vinyl, vinyl Fiend figure. Five bucks. The other ones in the set is Hulk Hogan, Seth Rollins, Roman Reigns, and Cena. Thought this was pretty cool, so I grabbed it. And then I scrolled on over to my collectible store. And... I'm not sure if I ever took the video or if I need to add it, which if I do, it'll be after this video. But I recently got two other Funko Pops from this Cartoon Network line that they're doing. And so today, I saw your boy Johnny Bravo, and I had to pick him up. I only need, let me see, three more. On the back of this box for this whole series. So that's what I'm going for. Johnny Bravo. If you don't know. You weren't lucky enough to be born. To watch this sick ass show. The other thing. That I picked up. Because my buddy told me that. Just the other day Triple H has finally retired. From in ring competition. Due to his health conditions that he has going on. So while I was at my collectible store. I picked up. This super sick international figure of Triple H. It's the King of Kings. It's got three face moldings. I know you can't see it too well because of that. But it's definitely an import. Because I cannot read none of that. So, I got this. This is sick. Triple H just retired. So his stuff's going to be going up in price. And then, show off some of the small stuff. I love my pins. I have a pin board going on. So I had to get a couple more pins. We got me some controllers, some PlayStation controllers. And I got me, it's like a skateboard and this droopy ass smiley face. I really like the smiley face. Looks dope. So there was that. And then, um... Arcade Pop, during our Christmas box, I believe, got me a Darby Allen <clears throat> figure that was on my list for AEW figures. Well, out and about today, at my collectible store, 
I found this version of Darby Allen. It says the face of TNT with his like crazy ass tree painting and the TNT title. So I picked this up and now I officially have every single figure from the series one lineup. So I picked that up. I think that's all I got for you guys. Let me check into the bag of goodies. Yep. That, I believe, is all I got for you guys today. But I have to plug them while I'm showing off their stuff. I get all my collectibles, all my Funkos from our sick, sick shop. Out the box. They have a website. Go ahead and check them out if you're in the Colorado area. Definitely check these guys out because they're sick. They're always switching up inventory. I've been in there like eight, nine times. And literally besides maybe twice, it's always different shit when I go in there. So, there's that, guys. But, hope you guys have a great, wonderful evening or day, whatever it may be. Make sure you guys hit the like button. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. If you're already subscribed, I appreciate you guys chilling and being along for the ride. Here very soon, just got confirmation that this big, big Chucky video I'm working on, the item is about to be here in two days. It just got shipped. So, really soon, I'm going to have something fucking big. Maybe one of the biggest things I've done on my channel. So, keep an eye out for that, guys, because it's going to be fire. But, until then, hope you guys have a good day. Good night, whatever it is, wherever you may be. Catch you guys on the next one.